Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So it's Sunday the 27th of August, and today is another What I Eat in a Day. Um, I'm currently following a slim and well plan, trying to lose some weight. It's going all right. I'm sort of finding my groove again. And I'm currently following the SP plan, especially for the next week until I go away on holiday. Just trying to get my weight down a little bit more before I go away, sort of damage limitation. Um, and I'm loving it. I'm absolutely loving it. So I've done four days now on SP and I've got another week ahead of that. And I'm just going to stick with it. And it's just, I don't know, it's, it's working out fine. Um... So I hope you're all okay. Thank you for everyone that keeps coming back and watching my videos. Honestly, it's greatly appreciated. If you're new here, thanks for clicking on my video. If you've enjoyed my content by the end of it, I hope you'll consider subscribing as well. That'd be lovely. There's um, lots of gorgeous people that follow these. And then um, people tend to really comment more on my um, weighing results. I don't get that many comments on my What Are You To The Day videos, but honestly, I would love for you to leave any comments down below and things or things you've tried or maybe your favorite foods just now or recommendations, anything at all, please, please feel free just to leave a comment. Um, I love reading your comments and it means loads to me. So yeah, comment away. Um, so the plans for today is going to be an allotment day. We just need to get on top of it like so much. Um, so yeah, that's going to be a lot. I'm going to have a bit of breakfast now, which is probably going to be, I've got a third of pot left of that skier yogurt. So I'm gonna probably have that and just some berries, the same as what I've had for the last couple of days. And then we'll hopefully be mixing it up again through the week with some like interesting breakfast and things. I'm wanting to try and make some waffles one day. I found my waffle maker, so I think um, maybe make some waffles maybe on Tuesday or something. And um, when the husband's gone back to work, I can just like faff about and we'll have an experiment. So yeah, I'm gonna go down to the alarm and have my breakfast first try and drink more squash. Yesterday was such a good day. I felt really positive. All the little changes I've been thinking about, I managed to kind of implement yesterday. So that was good. So yeah, normally I just drink Pepsi Max and cups of tea, which is not the best. You should, you know, I don't really drink water or juice. So yeah, I had managed to have two big um, things of squash yesterday, sugar-free squash. That was good. I went for a walk after my evening meal, which I've chatted about before. So I did like a half hour walk, which was really lovely. I mean, you've seen that on yesterday's video as well. We're literally just like, just like two minutes away from like beautiful um, like village ponds and things and walks along the riverside. So really, really lucky, quite rural really. Um, so yes, that was nice, we did that after tea. And then I didn't have my crunchy, my regular evening crunchy. I have a, I've had a crunchy every night probably for about the last, I don't know, two, three months. Um, it's just become a habit. And then like it gets to the point, like my husband will be like, oh, do you want your crunchy? And he'll have his crunchy. And more and more recently, I haven't been having it at the same time as him. I was like, oh, we can bring it through, I'll have it later. And it's sat there. And I'm honestly just thinking like, was I eating it? Because it was just like part of our routine. You know, you kind of get like in your little ways and your habits. So, um, yeah, last night I had my little picky plate instead. I thought, I'll have that first, see how I feel. And then if I want to have the crunch, I can have it. And I dare say, maybe calories wise, it's not that far different, the picky plate from the crunchy, but um, it was just speed and um, healthy A. So actually, you know, it's the way your body deals with that, I suppose, and breaks it down and stores it, it's a lot better than a crunchy, which is just sugar in it. So I was really proud of myself, and that is literally the first night in ages that I hadn't eaten it. And it's fine, and it's not, I could have had it if I wanted it. So yeah, I'm not depriving myself. I'm just really enjoying SP, and I don't know, you know, some kind of, something's just clicked. So that's really, really good. So yeah, I'm, I'm just waffling on. I'm just laughing, it looks like I've got a hat on. <laughs> Maybe not. Um, <laughs> sorry. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go get my breakfast and I'll bring you down with me to the allotment. I've got um, quite a few jobs to do and um, mainly deal with that collapsed blooming pumpkin arch. My heart is broken. <laughs> it just grew so well. I can't believe. I've seen other people's pumpkin arches. I know this isn't like a gardening chant bit here, but um, and honestly, they're so tiny and mine had gone like a triffid. And so I, I just... A victim of its own success. <laughs> right then, let's go and get some food. Right, so breakfast, <laughs> as the last couple of days, I've got my Arla Skia, which is not percent. That's my protein. I've got my berries, which are all speeds. We've got strawberries, blueberries, 
raspberries and then my brambles from the allotment. I've got a teaspoon of runny honey and I do use a measuring spoon um, to make sure it's just the right amount. Only because I'm just like super serious. I dare say you could just drizzle a bit over. But if you wanted to do it properly, because it is one thin for the honey. So yeah, it'd be dead easy to go over. But you get quite a lot. Um, now, if you think you don't like skier, I'd say give it a go like this with something on it. or flare it. Because when, they've, um, when I try it without anything on it, just plain, I really am not fond of the taste. But... With the berries and the honey and everything, I actually really like it and I have enjoyed it. So I'm pleased I've um, tried that. Plus, normally, right, this is so bad because food is so expensive. Often when I've bought fruit and things in the past, like berries, I maybe eat a couple of them and then I end up wasting them and they're going out. But I've just finished my blueberries, just finished my raspberries. I've only got a few strawberries left and obviously the brambles are just from the allotment. I'm going to pick some more today. But I've eaten my berries. Um, I did probably fancy something else for my breakfast this morning. However, I had to finish my pro my yogurt. That needed finishing off. And yeah, my raspberries were so close to turning. So you just can't waste your food, can you? <laughs> you really can't. So yeah, that is my breakfast for one thing. And it is S and P. Oh, I look crazy. It is a pouring down. And I'm at the allotment. Here you can see. And... I am obviously starving. It is now five past one. I've been in here about 20 minutes, half an hour hoping it's gonna sort of stop raining, but it isn't. So I'm gonna go home and get some lunch. I think it's a good excuse to um, have the rest of the afternoon off <laughs> doing nothing. So yeah, we'll go back. I've got, I did bring my um, my juice with me. So I'm making my way down there. As you can see, I'm doing so well. I brought a pot with me as well, but I haven't drank any today so far. So yeah, I'm really pleased with that. So I'm gonna go back and have some lunch because I am starving. Lunch today, I've got my healthy bee seeded protein bagel, um, two slices of bacon, I've got my mushrooms for speed, my eggs on the top, which is also free in protein, and the bacon obviously is free in protein. I'm gonna have half a sin of brown sauce and then add on some salt and pepper as well. And that will be my lunch. For tea tonight, I've um, made a... Oh, what is it? Hunter's chicken. Hunter's chicken, thank you. Um, so Hunter's chicken, this is on the Slimming World app. I'll pop a little screenshot of it in here so you can see which one you're looking for. Um, I've used my second healthy A mm. of cheese. Nice. Mm -hmm. So this is an extra mature cheese. It's not reduced fat one. Um, so that way I've got 30 grams as a healthy A. On the top there, um, chicken breast obviously in the sauce, all homemade. Green beans, which are speed, they're from my allotment. Instead of chips, I've made butternut squash chips, so they're speed and free. And I've also got the asparagus, which is speed and free. So yeah, that is my SPT. So for my supper tonight, I was going to have a crunchy, but I thought, nope. So I'm gonna have a little pack of these mini cheddars. They're the 30% less fat ones, so they're three and a half sins. I've got um, an apple for speed, pickled onions for speed, gherkins for speed. And then I've already used my two healthy A's today. So I've got two mini baby bell lights. I'm going to sin them. So that's four sins for the two mini baby bells. So yeah, that should be all I need to eat for the rest of today, hopefully.